Yo, what is going on YouTube? It is OG and we are finally back. So guys, Power League just came out. Um, you can probably tell I look very tired. It is, let me see the time, 8.30 a.m. So I haven't slept in like over a day, but we've just been grinding Power League. Um, unfortunately, I did start not in the highest one possible. I started gold two, my teammates started gold three. So they're like plat or diamond, whatever it's called. They're ahead of me. But this is pretty much how it goes down. So any of the maps in the Brawl Stars Championship pri or Finals Qualifiers, whatever it is, they are available to play. Okay, we actually got Backyard Bowl. We have not, we got this map once. We've gotten like such bad maps all night. We're like not getting any Brawl Balls. So it's nice to finally get it. So first off, Jigsaw is our captain um, <laughs> for Power League. Um, and he is gonna ban along with their team doing blind bans, I think, because I'm pretty sure I've seen the same brawler ban from both sides. So, Dog, Mr. Ruffs, Colonel Ruffs, Mr. P, again, 8.30 a.m., no sleep. Those are gonna be the bans. Oh, I'm first pick, I should pay attention. <laughs> uh, where's Byron? I wanna play Byron. Okay, we're gonna pick Byron. If we miss it, we get kicked out. So, good thing we picked Byron quickly. I think we get kicked out. I don't know. I always, like, catch it at, like, one second. So, I haven't gotten kicked out yet. Um, hopefully, I don't do that during the YouTube video. But I'll probably do two matches. I'm not sure. I don't really recognize anyone on the other team. But hopefully, it's a good game. We've had some pretty solid games so far. Um, we face, like, a few pro teams and stuff like that. So it's definitely fun when you get into those competitive modes and I really like the draft aspect. But I think our team comp's looking pretty solid so far. We should be able to make Bobby BS pretty much invincible with uh, speed and healing. They do have B though, B's a good pick. And Brock just got a buff too, so this will be interesting. I think, I think we should be fine though. So hopefully Jig lets me go mid. All right guys, game number one. Um, so Byron is probably one of my better brawlers right now. <laughs> I hope I don't choke because I'm tired. Um, so we're just gonna back off, let them spam out a few shots, and we're gonna go for some damage just to build our super up. I can probably just pass Bobby the ball and he'll score. Yeah, so they just let Bobby walk by, and he can just walk it in on the Brock, honestly, and that it's gonna be as simple as that, so don't let Shield V just walk down your lane, guys. And I didn't even have to heal him. He just like literally just bodied his way down the lane. So he's gonna need our help on the B though. And we are gonna give him some heals, but it's gonna not be enough. So I'm just gonna pop my gadget to stay alive. Gotta watch out, Brock can score here. So uh, he dodged our one shot. So that is gonna let him, it was a good dodge by him. And um, you know, Bobby's gonna switch lanes, yeah, so. He can definitely do a lot better on the 8-bit. I'll give him a heal and we'll just put the ball up a little bit. We'll throw our super out and we can take the Brock out too. This should be game. So we'll give Jiggy some heals. Just go. Scored. What are you doing, Jigsaw? Okay, Jigsaw doesn't want to win. Um, he's going to pass to Bobby, but Jigsaw definitely could have scored there. <sighs> so, hold on. We don't really have a wall break. Only downside, I should be more aggro. Uh, hopefully they break their own walls. Kind of nice. We can just wait for Bobby and he can just kind of force his way through. Hopefully, uh, yeah, I got hit by two shots and because of the 8-bit turret, but we should have won the game already. I don't know why Jigsaw didn't want to score there. It's kind of weird. So, by the way, best pin in the game. Then our New Year pins. Very OP. Um, we are going to push our way up slowly. We want to get rid of that 8-bit turret. But we also want to make sure Bobby... Okay, Bobby can just score if I super the ball up to him, I think. I'm lagging a little bit. Jig... Just score. Jigsaw, just score, please. Just score. Just score. Alright. That is going to be game number one. So it's as easy as that with Byron and, like, Max or, like, anyone, like, relatively tanky. Just got to heal them. And a lot of the times they will be able to score. <sighs> so I don't think Bobby's just walk-up strat is going to work again. Um, so we will give him some heals though, and you know what? we'll put it to Jigsaw's side and we'll tap the Brock once. Bobby's gonna get nice, he'll take out the B and he can just pass it. And this should be a goal, so we'll play for my teammates. I didn't really have to do much, I think I hit like one shot, kind of pressured them, but um, that is just how it goes with max comp sometimes. You literally don't have to do anything, you just kind of walk up and get position. And yeah, that is gonna be game as long as. 
Jigsaw? Okay, there we go. So we will take our first game. I'll probably do one more, maybe? We'll see how it goes. All right, guys, game number two. Momo missed all of you guys. Say hi, Momo. Four Lilo. <laughs> um, so we got Nuts and Bolt this time. We've gone this map a few times. I really like Tick. They also uh, completely reworked his one little dash gadget. Now it has six mines, it's really good. So both uh, yeah, both of us banned Colonel Ruffs. So it is blind bans. Uh, oh, right. Every single time, I always forget it's me. So I'm gonna take Tick. Uh, like I just said, I've been enjoying him. I'm gonna do the new gadget. It is really good for getting the first bolt, which is really huge. And you can kind of like spam out like the second bolt too, or third bolt. But they're gonna pick Dynamite. Um, Dynamite Jesse. So Tick's pretty good into this so far. We'll see what Bobby picks. Um, but I think I don't recognize these players either, so hopefully it's good. Alright, so we have double thrower. It's kind of risky in draft. Colette. Interesting. So they wanted to pick Colette into double thrower max. I mean, I guess it's okay into max, but I would have picked like a BB or like even a Mort maybe. Um, so yeah. They don't really have anyone fast, so I think I'll just let Jigsaw... I'll send it out, but I think I'll save my gadget. Okay, he's going to gadget too, so... Um, yeah, Jigsaw should be able to just hold that one down. And you can see the six mines. It's just so much area denial. They also changed the way that uh, Tick's shot explodes. So now it's a lot wider. Before it was more clumped up. It's better for area denial, but one thing that I did notice is before you could just auto-aim the safe and it would hit all three shots, and you can't do that anymore. It literally goes around it, so if you're lucky, you'll hit like one shot if you just auto the save. So it's kind of sad, but um, you know, if you do the gadget, I think you can get three. So I'm gonna throw my ticket on the other side so the Jesse doesn't hit it. Hopefully it makes it to safe. Yeah, nice, it's gonna connect, and we get it down to about 40, 30%, so that's really good, and we can just keep them out of lane as long as possible with Tick. Like I said, really good area denial. We don't even need this gadget right now. We'll throw this at the Dynamic just to kind of waste a shot. He's gonna jump over it. The Tick does not care. The Tick is going straight for that Jesse or whoever it hit. And we should be able to finish it here. Honestly, their comp is kind of troll. I have no idea why they would pick Colette into it. So one of the downsides is, it's not a downside, but you gotta be really sure about your comp because there's no, it's just like the best of three on a map. You can't change comps. So I like it because, you know, it's fast and efficient. We can finish here. But uh, you gotta be really sure of the comp that you chose. So at the end, you could kind of see that the tick gadgets or tick suit like attack was just everywhere. So it's harder to hit the safe now, only downside. I think it's better for bounty though. So it spreads more and you can get like, bounty was more like poke anyways, so. It's definitely fine there. Again, we can just throw some regular shots and then for this one, we can throw a gadget just to kind of like secure first spot for sure. Um, we'll help Jigsaw out there and he's gonna dive in on the Colette. We'll just keep the Jesse away from that as long as possible, but it's fine. We're gonna get first spot and honestly, I think we go for a one push. Uh, I do have my tick head and Bobby has super. He's gonna chip it down. Did he hit it? Yeah, okay. So Bobby's gonna hit that. And we're just gonna go for it, honestly. Okay, I'll tank for the bot. Um, and yeah, you can see, unfortunately, I'm only hitting like one right now, but we're gonna one push anyways. Really straightforward game. Unfortunately, we didn't get super competitive games like I was hoping for. Uh, these guys, so I think that's silver one, gold one, gold two. So I'm gold three, my teammates are diamond. Um, but. You know, you guys understand the mode and hopefully you guys like this kind of content because I've been enjoying this and I definitely want to do more content on Power League. So, yeah guys, I'll try to upload more consistently. Uh, like I said, I'm enjoying Power League and I want to do some pro gameplay as well. We're in a lot of tournaments. We just got second. Yeah, I know, second. <laughs> Say this last year. In uh, the monthly finals. So we're in the Queso Cup too. I'll upload some of those games and like qualifiers and stuff like that. But that is going to be it for today's video. I got to focus on my power league 
it is 8.30 a.m. And yeah, I'll see you guys soon. Peace.